Yes, hello friends, sisters and brothers in Christ Jesus. You know, we still have human side to us. God called us to the nations. But we still have human side, but we like to laugh. I know I do. You know. And uh, I was one of those bought a lot of Tyler Perry's movies. Well, I was watching a preacher on uh, YouTube. And he, he was right. He said, black folks, we've been played by this man here. By this drag queen. Okay? We've been played. We've been played. We made this man a billionaire. And he ain't thinking about none of us. So, my reason for coming out here, TikTok, this is for educational purposes, okay? Educational purposes, okay? Yes, we have a human side to us where we laugh. I know I like to look at things where I laugh. You know, I, I, I got another side. If you get around me, I'm telling you, uh, when we used to have reunions in my family, they were waiting for me to hit the door because they know I was coming in there. Everybody was going to be lit up <clears throat> and we was going to laugh. So this is, you know, something not, you know, to make us laugh because, but he did, he had a lot of funny movies. I was one of those busted Walmart's door wide open going for Tyler Perry's movies. I bought just about every last one of his movies. But like the preacher said, some later on, God started convicting me. <coughs> Praise God. He started convicting me. He said, you get rid of every last one of them movies. After I began to look deep into what this man was doing, I had to get rid of every last one of those movies. He is a drag queen. Now, if you go on YouTube and listen to one of the preachers, he was talking about, and he's right, absolutely right. I've been wanting to speak on about this here. Why couldn't he find a big black woman? A big heavyset woman to play that part for him? Why did he want to be a woman? And he no goodness well, God created him to be a man, a male. Okay? Black woman. Black folk. He got rich off of us. I heard about everything he got built in uh, Georgia over there. Studios and everything. Now, he may be helping some people. But he's, he's not who I thought he was. I was deceived for a moment. When all the movies, Tyler Perry's movies came out. I was one of those deceived until God pulled my coattail and said, I dare you. You take every last one of them moves and trash them. Or take them to the goodwill somewhere. You got to take them somewhere. You get them out your house, every last one of them, which I did. So this man played on our emotions. That's what he done. I mean... If God created you to be a male, then why are you want to, you know, act like you a uh, 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 grandma, you know, my dear and all that stuff. I mean, everything is cool only if you would have got, you could have got, uh, I'm thinking the same way this preacher uh, was thinking. I'm glad he brought it out. You could have found a heaven set beautiful woman. There are heaven set pretty women. Wouldn't have mind playing my dear for you. So why would you want to be my dear and a male? That don't make sense. Well, God brought it to my attention. The black folk got played. And we helped make you a billionaire. That's what happened. I'm guilty as charged because I bought all your movies. But I was going through a lot of emotional things 
in my own life during that time. And you know, when you just sitting up in your apartment, you alone by yourself, and you don't have nothing to do, you just want to laugh, you, you, you know? Same thing for Martin Lawrence. I bought all his movies, all his, see, I, I'm talking about, I was always in Walmart searching for something just to make me laugh. I bought all his CDs. One day God said, get rid of all of them. These people have sold their soul. I don't want to have no parts of that. And I'm not trying to condemn nobody. I'm telling you, I, I, God condemned me. But he told me, don't have no part in the fruits of unrighteousness. And my message with what's going on now, God is exposing the entire church. He said in his word, in the book of 1 Peter, he's starting with the church first. And he's going to... Expose the church. The Bible says, everybody, everyone, is going to be known of their fruit. You shall be known about your fruit, who you are. So how could you try to twist the mind of people? What is you doing to give back to some of these communities? You can't be hot or cold, Tyler Perry. I'm, I may be the first one to tell you. But uh, there are other preachers online. I'm not saying what they saying. I'm saying what the Holy Spirit will have me to tell you. Because a lot of times, you all think because y'all are rich, y'all are untouchable. You all are unreachable. But I'm here, I stopped by to tell you, Tyler Perry, if you run across this here video, it's time for you to repent. Repent and turn from that drag queen way. Because God said, I'm coming back, I'm, I'm coming back, and I'm going to judge everything got breath in his mouth and breath in his lungs. I'm telling you, he said he's going to do it. time to repent. You confusing the mind of these young people out here, Tyler Perry. Either you hot or cold. As a matter of fact, let me take you down this road in the book of Revelation. The Odyssey of church. God spoke, to, he called out seven churches. John, the uh, uh, Apostle John, he laid those seven churches in the book of uh, Revelation. The Laodicea church says, I would if you were hot or cold. If you are lukewarm trying to play in the middle, God said, I'm spew you out of my mouth, Tyler Perry. Yeah, we got played by you, but I forgive you. I was one of your number one fans buying your movie. But I can't do it no more. God told me to call it out. Unless you repent. And you, your, your testimony touched my heart so deep. Because you said you was you homeless. God brought you from a homeless position. And he elevated you so high. And look what you've done to the blessing. It's always out kind gonna turn on us and try to hurt us and bring us down always god is calling you to repent tyler perry your money can't get you into heaven you can't be the middle man in this thing god said i'm coming back to judge you by your fruit no matter there are king and queens in the bible god demoted he put, let them hit, hit, uh, hit the ground so hard, fall down so hard, you, you, don't, you didn't even know that name anymore. God is exposing the church right now. I'm speaking out because we been we was, we was messed over. I pray that this message, you find this message and you repent, Tyler Perry. In Jesus' name I pray. I love you guys.